Hello, today I wanted to show you this new pen I got. It is a Pilot Acrobol white line, and um, they come in different colors. It's a multi-pin that has correction tape in the top. So um, they were sold out on jet pins pretty immediately. I think they come in pink and blue, black, green, maybe orange and white. And um, I wanted the white, and so I went on Amazon. And they had several of the colors available. I don't know if they had all of them. I can't remember. The price was pretty close to jet pens, um, but they were available. It just took a while for it to get shipped to me. In fact, I actually forgot about it, and <laughs> then it was in my mailbox today. And it looks like it shipped from, I don't remember where it said on the packing list, but it was definitely not in English. So um, it shipped from overseas, and I wanted to try it out with you guys. So you can see that it has three colors, black, red, blue, and it's a 0.7. And um, I think this is telling me it's five millimeter correction tape and you get two and a half meters. That's my guess. So this is what the packaging looked like that I got and it just came in an envelope. Um, if you can read this, then hopefully that's readable to you. Uh, the back, it just has instructions, <coughs> excuse me, on how to use the correction tape. So it looks like you just flip up the top, use the correction tape, and when you want to replace it, you just pull off the end, and then um, you can buy these little replacement correction tapes on Amazon as well as jet pens. So the packaging was pretty simple. I just wanted to unbox it with you guys and try it out. I wanted the white because I thought it looked cool. So my first impressions, this is very grippy. I think you can see that it's textured. It's not soft at all. It's, um, you have to forgive. Wow, look at, they don't look that bad in real life, but up close in camera, whew, washing dishes does a number on them. Um, so you can see that it's textured and it's not soft, but it's definitely, you know, it grips. Um, it looks like here are the indicators for what color you're using. And my guess is that when this lines up with one of those, it will pop out. So let's see, it turns. That's exactly what's going to happen. <laughs> it doesn't turn any further past black. So let's see. Here's blue and red. So it only goes to black and then to red. It's got just a regular standard clip and it just says Pilot Acrobol White Line. And I've got to make this quick because my baby is crying. And let's see. Just flips up and there's the correction tape. So. I haven't wanted a pen in a while, um, but when I saw this, I'm like, okay, multi-pen, like it. Acrobol, love it. That's one of my favorite pens. Um, and correction tape in the top, come on, you've got me. And it wasn't that expensive. I, I don't I don't remember how much I paid for it, but it was like, you know, I wanna say more than $5, but definitely no more than $10. So let's start with the black, and you can see that the refill on the bottom also indicates what color it is so I haven't used this yet so let's perfect right out of the the, the uh, gate there so it's definitely the smooth ink vibrant it glides just like a regular acrobol writes perfectly To me, that doesn't even look like a 0.7 line. That looks, to me, like something much smaller. It looks more like a 0.5. Um, so I like that because that's even better for me. So it's nice ink. I'm just looking to see if it skipped any. It did not skip. It just wrote smoothly and it worked perfectly. So we're gonna try the correction tape. Just to speak quickly, about the um, way it feels in the hand. This is a super lightweight pen. In fact, I just wanna kinda of hold it compared to like like my Dr. Grip. I, I feel like this is a very lightweight multi-pen. It's nice and comfortable. I like the size of the, the, the grip area. It's comfortable in the hand. Um, I like the way it looks. It's just kind of understated except for right there. That's really the only the only thing on the pen. It's really nice. It's It feels good. Um, if this correction tape works well, I would say this is an excellent pen for a student or well, just anybody that wants to have multicolors at their tip at the tip of their fingers and the ability to correct. So let's see how this works. I just flipped up this little lid and now he's really crying so I gotta hurry here. And it's gotta go this way. Is that the way it goes? 
take it the wrong way? I guess I did go the wrong way. Oh, that's weird. That's not the way that I would think it would go. I'm just looking. Oh, yeah. So you're going to put the cap behind it, and you're going to roll it this way. I would have thought it would roll this way, but it did not. So I need to now try again. So let me just make a mess here. Okay. So let's see how that works. I think you can see this. So I kind of messed up the first part of it because I, I rolled it the wrong way. So let me just, now that it's, it's a fresh piece, let me just try. That was my fault for not following the picture directions. Okay, so see, now I have a fresh tip. Um, I had kind of messed up how it was on there. So open it up, turn it this way, read the directions. <laughs> and just, I'm just pretty much going like, straight up and down. I just tore a little bit of that tape, so let's try again. This might, you might need like a certain angle that the directions are telling me that obviously I can't read. Um, so I'm just going to kind of hold it maybe at, ah, uh, perfect. Okay, so you can't hold it straight up and down. That's just a little, a little too, um, that's just not going to work. Um, and so I would say, what is this angle? Maybe like a what is that? Like a, a 70 degree angle? Something like that. It's not quite 45, but it's, it's somewhere between 45 and 90. Um, and I'm just applying, I am applying some pressure and then to like cut it off. I just like that. This is pretty cool. I think once you get the hang of the angle, it's not bad. And you know, all correction tape that I have, it doesn't matter what brand, it, it doesn't, it'll sometimes pop up like, you know, on the page and you just kind of have to push it down a little bit. Just these dry correction tapes, I've, I've found that with every brand. So I'm just going to do this, that, and if I just go like that, it's perfect. That is really cool. Do you see how it kind of like lifted there a little bit? I, I find that to be the case with all correction tape, but once I figured it out, that's how it looks. That is really a great idea. I can't believe somebody hasn't thought of that sooner. And then you just put the little lid back on and you're good to go. And let's see, I think to replace it, all you do is just, yeah, you just pull this whole, oh, look at that. There's your tape. So you just pull this whole little piece out and I wonder if that's how you do the refills too. Wish I could read whatever language that is. I'm assuming it's Japanese, but I could be wrong. Um, so you see that just has a little piece there. You just slide it right back in and um, that's it. So that is super easy to refill that way. And how do you get, my guess is, let's see, unless this, there we go. So this unscrews, there's how you're gonna replace your refills and it just screws back together. So this is, as far as I know, a brand new pen, at least in America, and um, it is awesome. If you're in the market for just a multi-pen that has correction tape in it, this is amazing. And I would say that like quality-wise, I mean this to me, like a Dr. Grip multi-pen is a little bit higher end um, because you're getting like metal barrel and you know metal pieces and stuff like that. But, um, so this is one of my favorite multi-pens, a Unijet Stream. I would say definitely somewhere in that quality. This feels a little bit better quality. It definitely feels solid and sturdy. This is, I don't think this pen is going to necessarily like break or crack or anything like that. And it feels much better than like, um, a Pilot Coletto or the, um, Zebra Prefill that I had. This is a, a really nice pen. Um, yeah, I, I like it. And if you like the Acrobol ink, you will like it. And it is, um one of my favorite inks, um, or one of my favorite types of pens. So this is the Acrobol that I have. And if you have one of these, the grip feels pretty much the same. Um, it has a similar look to it and it's just a great pen. So yeah, if you're interested in a multi-pen that has the correction tape on it, this is a great choice. Um, again, I got mine on Amazon, but they did have them on jet pens. They were sold out when I went to look and they had several different colors, but they were on Amazon. So if you're interested, check them out. If you have any questions about it, leave it in the comments below. Otherwise, um, yeah, if you're a multi-pen fan, 
I would definitely look into this. Uh, I've never seen anything like this before, and I don't know why until now. In 2019, has anybody not ever thought to put correction tape on the end of a multi-pen? Brilliant. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.